So Tara, thank you for showing us your newsletter. Um, um, and we're looking at this in the spreadsheet because we're looking at other data, but your newsletter, I just wanna, you know, just had some suggestions for you here. Um, one is that, uh, you know, I like, well, of course, I like that you're, you're doing something similar to me where you're basically linking people to the latest articles. But what I, what I do, I think that that's really helpful is I put a couple paragraphs um, before the link. And so if you go to my newsletter, I'll just show you real quick. Um, and uh, actually there's one going on today, um, but anyway, it doesn't matter. I'll, I'll show you this one. Um, you know, I put, I put enough, enough where people would be like, mm. okay, that's interesting. I wanna read more and then they would read it. Okay. So that would, I think that would, that would improve your click rate. And the other thing okay. you might notice in mine is that I only have th like, okay, four. This is my monthly newsletter, so I have four. In my weekly newsletter, I only have three pieces of, pieces of content to share and with an offer at the bottom. Sure. And so, um, <clears throat> so with yours, you have one, two, wait. That's is, the same one. That, yeah. This, oh, this is just so that blur. is the description. I would, okay. Yeah. So yeah. I would say the description should come first in a couple paragraphs and then a continued okay. reading. A continue okay. reading. At the, I mean, the title, I, I mean, well, of course I, I like my own format, otherwise I wouldn't use it. Right? So I mm. like my own format. I like, I like that there's a title, a couple of mm. paragraphs, and then, and then the continue reading or read and the article. You got it. Yeah. Okay. So anyway, try that out. Um, podcasts. Uh, yeah. So you essentially you have one, two, three pieces of content. Four. four okay. Four. Yeah. Right. And then mm -hmm. an offer. Um, mm -hmm. So I would, I would have named this free webinar because, oh, okay. yeah, I would just say free webinar and don't even okay. mention the price because okay. when they click through to the sales page, they will see that, oh, if I can't attend live, because when, when people see a webinar, they usually look for the date, you know, like immediate, immediate, the question we always get, when is it? Do you get a recording? <laughs> Two most common mm -hmm. questions for any virtual event. And so let them click through and find that out. But I think having that paragraph where, you know, yeah, that's, that's good. Yeah. Um, and you don't have to mention two times here, just let them click through and find out what the date and times are and stuff like that. So and did you get any replies to this one? Yeah. Like I said, I think just like maybe one or two people, not nothing that's I remember. Okay. Okay, great. That's, mm -hmm. that's fine. Uh, well, um, I hope this helps for your upcoming newsletters. So yeah, sort of thanks. some some easy some easy changes, right? For yeah. Next time. Here yeah. we go. Good. Absolutely. Great. Absolutely. Thank you.